hello my loves and welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a clean and decorate with me for christmas if you are new here welcome my name is rogina and i film a variety of cleaning videos diys and home decor if you like what you see go ahead and give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bells so you are notified every time i upload a video now let's hop right into it refrigerator needed a good wipe down so I started there and I'm actually glad I did because it took longer than I was expecting I forgot about all of the different compartments and drawers that you have to wipe down and clean out and take everything out of the refrigerator Small talk with people that pass me by. I share and laugh, it gives me joy that everyone's happy. And I am just using hot water and done dish liquid to wipe everything down. So, some of the things I had in my refrigerator, I actually ended up freezing. Like, I had a couple of uh, bags of shredded cheese, I went ahead and froze those, and then I had a few boxes of butter, I went ahead and froze those so they wouldn't go bad. I always stock up on butter and cheese when it's on sale and just freeze it. Let me know down in the comments if you do the same. No. It's the time of year, winter wonderland. My winter wonderland is the time of year. My winter wonderland, my winter wonderland. I want to sing about the Christmas on its way. A reason to hang around and celebrate this day. Everyone's smiling and it's snowing. It's the time of year again. I'm happy you're here. My winter wonderland. In my hand, and the boys are lining up for my kisses of the one special guy. He's a dream though of a man, my own sweet buttercup. I'm just so wrapped up by his praise. So I don't know why I tried to do this with those water bottles. I knew they were gonna fall, but something in my head was like, yeah, do it. I, yeah, I don't know why. Remedy right here by the Christmas tree. 
I'm just taking the compartments out and wiping everything down. sure I wipe down all of my condiments so they are not all sticky and nasty when I put them back inside the refrigerator. have so many condiments in this refrigerator y'all it was ridiculous i ended up finding three open bottles of mayonnaise i don't even know how that happened but yeah So now on to the table, I'm just using soap and water to wipe it down. I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill So now at this point we are just putting things away and clearing off the counters It is amazing how much stuff accumulates on these counters every day so one of the main reasons I always keep a tray or something large on my island is because if I don't, it will look exactly like this stuff everywhere.
So of course I'm using my vinegar cleaner to spray down the countertops and like I've said in previous videos my countertops are laminate. I would not use this on, on countertops. Of course, I had accumulated some dishes from cooking breakfast that morning and also cleaning out the refrigerator. You guys already know the routine. Whatever that doesn't fit in my dishwasher, I hand wash. As you can see, we love cooking with our cast iron skillets. I have two of them, and I also have a cast iron kettle that I got from my grandmother who had it for many, many years. They will last for decades if you know how to take care of them. And a lot of times you can find them at garage sales and thrift stores rusted because a lot of people don't know how to clean them once they rust. They are so worth the investment, you guys. Saying hi to every friendly face And later we warm up by the fireplace
outside It tingles in my heart Breathing air that clears my mind I'm all for a good start I hear those jingle bells People singing about love It feels like I'm a kid Like I'm forever young And that's why I want to sing about The Christmas on its way A reason to hang around And celebrate this day Everyone's smiling And it's snowing It's the time of year again I'm happy you're here My winter wonderland I'm walking around making small talk with People that pass me by I share a laugh, it gives me joy That everyone's having a good, good time I hear those jingle bells People singing about love It feels like I'm a kid Like I'm forever young That's why I want to sing about the Christmas on its way. A reason to hang around and celebrate this day. Everyone's smiling and it's snowing. It's the time of year again. I'm happy you're here. My winter wonderland. No. It's the time of year. Winter Wonderland, my winter wonderland is the time of year. My winter wonderland, my winter wonderland. I want to sing about the Christmas on its way. A reason to hang around and celebrate this day. Everyone's smiling and it's snowing. It's the time of year again. I'm happy you're here. My winter wonderland Oh, my winter wonderland Oh, my winter wonderland I've got a mistletoe in my hand So of course my stuff was covered in grease from cooking breakfast that morning and also I think my husband had cooked um, pork chops the night before. So I am using the oxygen orange decreaser. some burn on grease on my stove so I went in with my pink Brillo pads that I get from the Dollar Tree to kind of scrape and clean it up I don't know if this is something I would do with a brand new glass top stove our stove is older it was in our house when we moved in and it was already kind of damaged so um and and it doesn't look like the Brillo pads is making it worse I, honestly I can't tell because it's already damaged like I said before but um you can test it out and see
I'm kind of decorating as I go, so I'm trying to figure out where I want to place things and how things look grouped together. This lantern I bought from Aldi last year. I think it was $10. The little um, tulips in the glass vase, I got those from at home. Um, they were like 75% off at the end of last season. The three little glass mercury trees you see, I got those from Roses. I think they were like $10 for all three. The large apothecary jar I bought about five years ago from Marshalls, I believe. I actually bought it to use um, during our wedding reception at our candy bar. This is a super simple Christmas DIY. If you have a large vase or pocket carriage jar, just fill it with your leftover um, Christmas ornaments and Christmas balls. Throw a bow on that bad boy and voila, you are good to go. So that is it you guys thank you so much for watching i hope this motivated you to get up and clean with me and i will see you in the next one You're on top of my